Hey guys, you're welcome to another episode of Movie Recap. On today's episode, we're going to be reviewing a movie titled The Weekend Away. It's a very popular movie that just came out. It's a movie by Kim Farrant. Now, this movie AM centers on two characters. Um, those are my favorite characters from the play. That is Kate and Beth, played by Leighton Mister and Christina Wolf, two best friends. They've been apart for a long time. They wanted to spend time together to catch up. And it was looking all fun and interesting. I mean, they were partying, they were, were drinking. And it was all good for Beth because she she just had a baby and she wanted to... A friend encouraged her to go out more and see more people because apparently she was having issues with her marriage and all. And uh, everything was going on fine. They checked into this Airbnb. They had a nice apartment to themselves. They went clubbing. But you know, the, the lady that just got divorced was looking to have more fun, was looking to be more lively. But the lady that just had a baby was more conservative. She didn't want to drink, she didn't want to uh, you know, sleep with other men. But the lady that was just got divorced actually paid some guys to hang out with them because she wanted her friend to kind of like sleep with other people just to have a taste of what other men feels like and other stuff like that. Now, it was all fun and games until there was a mother. It changed quickly from that happy, jolly mood of two ladies just having fun to a crime scene. Now, this lady that just had a baby that's more conservative, more quiet, woke up the next morning after they went to club and she couldn't find a friend anymore. She couldn't find a friend anymore. She just now went to her room and was searching for her. And before you know it, there were pieces of glasses on the ground. There, were blo there was blood. And immediately she decided to call the police. There are a lot of suspects, like I said already, in this film. You from the taxi driver to the husband of both ladies. Uh, okay, well, one of them is divorced, to so the keeper of the Airbnb, to so even the police officer, everybody in this film. So even the Beth herself, to the main character. To the main she character herself. Like, at some point, she seemed like a She suspect. seemed like the person that they were even, like, kind of, like, blaming for the murder and... Um, she had the motive. She had the motive to want to, like, kill her friend. Yeah. Because in the film, it, at, as, as time went on in, in the film, it was revealed, it was revealed, now a little bit of spoiler here, it was revealed that this, her friend, was actually kind of, like, um, uh, having an affair with... Um, <laughs> No, 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 no. That's like a major spoiler. <laughs> major, <laughs> major, <laughs> major spoiler. We're not going to say it. So, um, I think, um, but, but generally, this is a, a classic um, crime film that um, it, 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 it keeps you on the edge of your seat. But at some point in the Did middle it? of this movie, yeah, so at some, this is what I was trying to say. On the, no. At some point in this movie, it was that like movie a felt too cool modern movie. Yes, yeah, so there was like not was really, cool, there was not cool. really fast paced since it was involving two ladies. I mean, I didn't mean it was involving two guys. Maybe we would have seen a little bit of more action. Maybe I'm shooting here and there, but there was no, there was no shooting in this film. It was just, it was just like a, a cool paced um, murder film. But at some point in this movie, in the middle of this movie, it felt boring. It felt boring. So you, at some point, I wanted to shut it down and just watch something else. But that was like right in the middle. But the beginning is action part, is fun filled, and the ending part is fun filled. But the middle, I think there was not enough action happening in the middle to want to hold your attention. The turning point was when they revealed, oh, this person is the killer. If I had shut down my system and said, oh, I'm not watching again, I would have just felt, oh, it's just normal. Because up from the beginning to that point, it was just going like, you could just predict that. You oh, could predict is, who the person is. This is. is. Meanwhile, was, it was someone totally it was somebody, different. So, I think that was, the, that was just the shiny yeah. star in that very dark movie. Mm -hmm. Not dark as in horror, but dark as in bleak. Just there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like like I said, there is, it's, it's not really, I, I wouldn't call it a, a fantastic movie, kind of. Is it? I'm, I'm not even sure it's, it's an award-winning kind of movie. No, it's not. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not an award-winning kind of movie, but it's actually quite interesting. Um, and so, and, and, and the film is it's set in a different country, in a country that we're not used to. You know, most films are set in the US or in the UK. This particular film is set in Croatia, a, a country that we don't usually see much in the movie. So I think and that's the interesting twist to it. Yeah, what would you like to say closing? Yeah, in closing, I feel ladies need to pay more attention to us, to themselves, because one of the major things the movie highlighted was the fact that 
Beth was a mom and then she lost herself in the process. And I feel probably after childbirth, we need to pay extra attention to herself. In as much as it was a mother movie, the reason why she came to Croatia in the first place was her friend Kate trying to drag her out of her shell. Like, you've been a mom for too long. You've forgotten yourself. Who are you? Who is the real you? I knew you before you got married and had a child. And I feel you can be more than this person I used to know, not this empty shell I'm seeing right now. All right, on the next video, we're going to be talking about the Adams Project. So if you've, if you've watched the Adams Project, watch our take on that particular film. Exciting, exciting film, exciting film. Subscribe to this channel and hit the bell notification. Don't forget to leave a comment. Tell us what you think about this movie, The Weekend Away. If you've watched this movie already, if you've not watched it already, go watch it. I hope you really didn't spoil so much of it for Netflix. you. I think it's on Netflix. Yeah, I think it's a Netflix film, but you can always download it, you know, yeah. the way we do it, you know. Uh, it, the way it does, I just watch on this. Like, Everybody downloads film. Like, come on now, come on now. Everybody downloads film. Like, you know, who pays for Netflix? Please pay for Netflix. <laughs> See you in the next video.